Well, according to me, if the CBI had to simply file in a, a suicide case, then abetment to suicide was definitely made out because, you know, abetment to suicide is something which is very subjective and would have gone to trial because the family has made out a very clear case that how Rhea, you know, sort of isolated him and uh, kept him away from the family and uh, how got, she got into the inner circle and uh, removed everybody from the inner circle. How she hid the uh, medical details from the family. How she, you know, ultimately left him without uh, handing over the medical records to the family. So probably CBI is looking at the murder angle. And that is why they are not able to file a charge sheet. And if there is a murder angle, then I am sure if abetment to suicide would have been a huge blunder. Because if you recall, the FIR is abetment to suicide only. But if some material has come out for uh, a murder, then I'm sure a CBI would. But the only thing which is worrisome from my point of view is that if they are looking at the murder angle, then by now they should have taken into, uh, taken into custody, you know, and done custodial interrogation of the uh, players who were at the residence, like Pithani, etc. And also Riya Chakravarti, because uh, uh, she definitely was aware of whatever was happening in the household. And her behavior, both before and after the death, was extremely suspicious. So, I, according to me, that is the worrisome part, because um, they could have easily filed a abetment to suicide case and, you know, filed the charge sheet. So now that they are looking into other angles and today also they've given a statement that yes. they're still investigating the matter very closely. So I'm quite hopeful probably they've got some electronic record, some other evidence, piece of evidence, which uh, probably they are looking at and probably they want to make out. Because if you recall, in Ashu Arushi Talwar, what a blunder the CBI had made, you know. So the real culprits went uh, free, the parents were uh, charge sheeted, they went for trial convicted, ultimately acquitted. So I don't want anything like that to happen in this matter. Even if they have to take time, they should come out with a proper, you know, if you recall the neck mark on the neck, the same doctor of Ames told me that this has this, this is 200% death by strangulation. And now he's saying that, no, 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 it is a case of suicide. So, so there is a lot of uh, flip-flop happening and uh, there is a lot of explanation for uh, to be to be sought by the CBI. All these aspects need to be looked at, and uh, the Parambir Singh has gone, so he actually tried to derail the investigation. So let's yeah. let's hope that something comes out of it very soon. Thank you. Well, one, just one just one question, uh, Mr. Mr. Singh. Uh, what do you make of the NCB investigation that's underway? Uh, you mentioned Siddharth Pitani, he's been arrested. Are you hopeful of some headway being made by them? Well, well, NCB, I will only say it is poetic justice. So under the NCB, uh, you know, case, uh, all these uh, main accused have gone in jail. So uh, NCB is not a case. But um, if there is some NCB angle, uh, it should definitely be investigated and uh, these people should be tried for that. But that, that really will not be justice to Sushant Singh Rajput. Justice to Sushant Singh Rajput will be only when his death is, uh, you know, taken to its logical end and not the NCB case per se. So, NCB, the only heartening thing is that at least uh, under the NCB uh, jurisdiction, these all, all these people have gone to jail and, and you know, suffered some sentences. But uh, that's about it as far as uh, uh, the family of Sushant Singh that discussed. One last question, Mr. Singh. Uh, a lot of viewers asking, in fact, you know, they've been really uh, glued on to this coverage and they've been hoping that something comes out of the CBI investigation. Now, they want to know how the family is coping with all these developments as they await justice? Well, family is basically doing a wait and watch uh, because uh, what else can the family do? Because we had asked for the CBI and uh, we have got CBI. So uh, we were not with Mumbai police. Uh, we went to Bihar. Then we asked for CBI. We got CBI. So we have to wait and watch. So family is, uh, as of now, you know, just uh, waiting uh, with hope that uh, something will come out of this uh, very soon. Okay, Thank you. last question. Are you sure, are you confident the CBI will be able to reveal the truth in the case? You have a new CBI chief, like you mentioned. I, I heard you say that you're expecting a charge sheet. Are you hopeful? Well, of course I'm hopeful. Of course I'm hopeful. And uh, I, I'm, I, I'm hopeful that something will happen very soon in this matter. Okay. Thank, Thank you, Mr. Vikas Singh. Thank you.